Hey everybody, this is Joanne from Texas checking in on P3, P4, day 30, I believe. Um, I was the same as I was yesterday, so um, that's cool. I'm about 3.2, 3.4 pounds above LIW, so that's cool. Uh, I went all the way up to like five pounds when I was on medication and all that above LIW. And then when I was ex first started exercising, um, I was going up and down. And pretty much I've been stable. Uh, I think the highest was like around five pounds, 4.8 pounds, something like that. So to be back down uh, three pounds, I'm happy with that since I have been exercising. Well, except for the last two days because my stupid toe. I'm so mad at myself. Like I told you yesterday, um, can't get a tennis shoe on. And evidently, as the s stupid ice cream bowl and chili was coming out of the freezer, evidently it hit my knee because I've got a huge bruise on my knee, too. <laughs> I'm falling apart. Anyway, I tried on a um, nether medium dress I got today. And this one fits me. So, I may have to send it back. And I know a medium, more than likely, I get these clothes from QVC. And it says that a medium is a 10 to 12. But more than likely, since um, I think they run a little big. So, uh, except for the other medium. I mean, it just depends on what brand you get. Because the other medium was tied on me. Uh, but this medium I could actually probably wear now if, if I needed to. Um, anyway, I'm going to have to quit buying clothes and see how I am uh, once I lose my weight. It's crazy. It's funny, though. It really is. It's funny. I feel really thinner today. I don't know why. I have no clue. I haven't measured. So, I don't know what the deal is, but I think that things have reshaped themselves in, in phase three, where um, my pants are, are bigger on me. So, it's, it's crazy in that outfit I tried on. Anyway, it'd be interesting to try on that other outfit I tried on, you know, a couple of weeks ago to see if it fits me any looser around the midsection. Start loading tomorrow. Going uh, out with my girlfriends. We're going to meet for an early supper around uh, 4 o'clock because that's when they get off work and there's no sense in them going home. And instead of having a margarita, which is one of my favorites, uh, it has so much sodium in it, and I always swell after I drink it. I'm thinking about getting my next favorite drink, and uh, which I found out in Jamaica this summer, uh, is a vodka and Sprite. I really love that. So anyway, uh, and I'm going to load on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, and I think probably by Sunday, I bet you anything, I'm going to want to load clean. And then um, Monday will be uh, round number nine for me. Now, you have to remember, <laughs> I started back in July of 2012 is when I started uh, didn't start HCG then. I think that's when I started vlogging. Um, I had started HCG two rounds before that. So when people say that this is not a race, it truly hasn't been for me. Um, I was used to doing short rounds, 20-day rounds. And so that's why I have so many collected, and that's... <laughs> That's why it's taking me so long. I think because of age, menopause, anyway. But that's okay. I'm fine with that. Um, I am 186 
seven now, I think. Or 186 something. I can't remember. Uh, and my book is in the room. Or I get it. I usually keep it here, but I took it in there in the room to transfer it to a new book. Uh, anyway, um, and I've got, uh, 30 more pounds to go. I want to get to 150 or so. So, uh, it's going to take me, um, several months to get that off. So, um, anyway, that's okay. Because this round, or even if I do another round, uh, will be the end for me so um it looks like it's going to take me because this july will be two years uh and uh this is what april april may june july. so that gives me four months maybe maybe i can do it in the four months we shall see because I think my last round was 60 days, and I think I lost 26 pounds. So maybe I can do it in just this one round if I make it a long one. I hope so. Keep your fingers crossed. Anyway, and then I would go on to life maintenance and be able to uh, keep my weight down. But see, I, I plan in my head. I, I plan for maintenance. That is my goal is life maintenance. So I'm always thinking ahead of the way in P3 and P4, this is a practice for me for life. And so um, my jazzercise is included in that. Uh, my daughter-in-law has lost two or three sizes since she's joined and my daughter has lost and kept it off. So uh, my, you know, my daughter is like a size two. So, jazzercise is really, uh, I mean, don't think it's like a fluffy exercise, because it's not. It's a very uh, good cardio strenuous uh, exercise, and I'm very uh, proud that I can get out there and keep up with the youngins. So, anyway, this is long, and my other one was long. I did my wedding shots, so I am going to go, and I hope everybody has a great day, and uh, I will... Maybe I'll make a drunk vlog tomorrow. Probably not. Not off one drink, I wouldn't think. You never know, though. All right, love y'all girls. Bye. Ooh, look at that. I need to paint that nail. <laughs> Bye.